always nice to be bogey free. How did you assess your round today? Uh, it was solid, really good through uh, 13 holes, especially. Um, just a couple pars, a couple loose shots coming in, but uh, scrambled really well when I needed to. Uh, kept it in front of me. Um, you know, there's there are huge wide fairways, so it's always a bit of a, a struggle to bring your focus in a little bit more narrow. And um, there's a few uncomfortable shots too, uh, but it was definitely a lot easier than it was with the wind yesterday. Are they removed from your birthday? Do you do any celebrating? <laughs> Not much celebrating. Um, we I had I had a dinner with with a, a couple friends out here on Tuesday, but. Um, Yesterday was a grind. It was hard work, and uh, it was really uncomfortable because the last three days we've been practicing, we've had like 20, 25 miles an hour of wind off the right on all the ranges, even the range at home at TPC Summerlin, and then uh, standing up first tee shot of the tournament, I've got 25 wind off the left, and it's just like a 50 mile an hour wind switch, and uh, I was like, please don't be wide open club face, um, but you know, managed it well. They're, they're just really uncomfortable shots, um, but then some ones where you just get it in the bowl and it goes right next to the hole. So um, just a mixed bag between some really hard, really easy shots out there. Let alone not an easy day condition-wise, but also Caddy brother wasn't feeling well. So yeah. how did that go for sure? Well, Scout, Scout toughed it out. I saw him this morning in dining. I was like, he does not look good. Um, and it put things in perspective because no shot I hit out there was harder than what he was going through today. So uh, he, he did great. Um, he's helped me so much the last couple weeks. And, you know, I think my good play lately has, has been a lot due to um, the help he's, he's given me over the last couple weeks. And uh, I'm excited he's going to be uh, caddying for me through the end of the season. I talked him into it. So um, the end of uh, East Lake. So. Uh, we'll have a lot of fun, and uh, he's, he's a better green reader than I am, so helps a lot. Uh, what's that relationship like, let alone calling golf shots, but having someone who probably knows you the best in between the shots? Yeah, he's, he's like, uh, if I could you know, tailor make a caddy, he's, he's helped so much. Um, we have a lot of fun, play a lot of golf when we're home. Um, you know, I, There's four of us, and we're all super close. We always feel like we're, we're a team. We're never really competitive with each other. We we're more of a, had more of a team mentality. And uh, you know, that's, I'm excited for, to get all four of us back together over Thanksgiving and, and play some brothers golf. And uh, but you know, it's it's awesome. They, they know we shared a room growing up all the way through high school, so uh, know each other extremely well. How much are you thinking about finishing in that fifth and sixth? Quite quite a bit. That's why I'm playing so much this fall. Um, I'm also playing a lot because I feel like I'm playing really well, and um, you know, my wife's traveling with me and. We don't have kids yet, and uh, might as well just go play. They're, they're handing out a check and handing out a bunch of points and a trophy, so and uh, living the dream, playing on the PGA Tour. But I think I'm in a pretty good spot for the, the top 60, and it feels like I'm playing with house money a little bit, and uh, I definitely am, am not envious of the position that a lot of most of the guys in this field are in. Um, it's a lot more stress-free golf for me, and I'm, I'm just out here trying to win the golf tournament. And, have some fun in Cabo and uh, see how good I can get my game before we get going again next year. Are you thinking more about Kapalua and Augusta? Absolutely. I mean, you know, item number one was getting Pebble and uh, Riv. Item number two was uh, top 50 in the world, Augusta, and, and three is Kapalua. So got one of those pretty much ticked off, I think, and uh, two more, cha three more chances to get those other two done. What were the best birdies today? Ooh. I think my best birdie today was 13. That was my last birdie. Um, that one was really good. There's a few shots out there where if you just hit it in a certain area, it funnels right to the hole. Um, I've had a lot of inside of five, six footers for birdie, which is really good for me. Iron play has been historically the weakest part of my game, so I'm really excited about how that's trending. Uh, and this is the most solid the putters felt in months, which is awesome. But 13 is probably the best one. Perfect. Cool. Done. Thank, Thank you. you. Appreciate it. Let me go put Thank mine you. Okay, sure, patience. No problem.